Hey, it's Gary from CreativeSkills.com. On uh, this project, uh, which is the swim platform uh, rebuild and refinish, I'm going to show you how to bed in the bolts for the uh, mounting brackets. The swim platform is composed of a foam core with two layers of glass, and carriage bolts have to go through those two layers and bolt it to the bracket that mounts it to the back of the boat. Now, if you just put the bolts in and you tighten them up, you're going to crush the fiberglass down, you're going to get all kinds of spider cracks on the top, it's going to ruin the finish that we just put on this thing. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put an epoxy plug inside where the foam goes, so it'll add some stiffness to it, so when you tighten the bolts, you can't compress that epoxy plug. It's going to be just equivalent to like a stack of washers in between the two layers of glass, except we're going to make that a solid epoxy. Okay, here's the hole that I've uh, that I've drilled. You can see the foam core inside there, and we're just going to uh, we're just going to fill that with epoxy and uh, pour it in. It's kind of cold out here today, so I'm not worried about adding too much and building up too much heat as you can when you get a, a large mass of epoxy together. And we're just going to put some thickened epoxy in there, pour it in flush on all these mounting holes. Uh, there's a whole bunch of them. There's eight all together. The two I did the other day when I laminated the bottom side of the far end of the platform. Uh, to make these holes, I just took a paddle bit like this one, and I drilled down uh, going through the uh, this layer of fiberglass, through the foam core, and then I poked the tip of the pilot uh, through the top, uh, which is not a big deal because the, car the bolts are going to be drilled through and they're bigger than the size of the pilot. They're like uh, 3 8 or 5 16 bolts that's going to hold this thing together in the end. So um, I'm going to mix up some thickened epoxy and uh, show you how we're going to fill that in. Okay, so we've got our uh, epoxy mixed up. Now on the bottom of these holes, on well, the top side of the platform, I put a piece of duct tape to cover up the hole that the pilot bit made going through. So um, I don't have to worry about all the epoxy running out the bottom. And now we're just gonna pour this in and uh, let it set, let it uh, level out. And that'll be that, let it cure up. Yeah, I think we got all the air bubbles out. That's it, and just kind of let it self-level, and we'll grind off the excess later. Okay, so here it is after the uh, resin has been poured in, the thickened epoxy. And we did the ones down here as well. So here's the repair that was done yesterday, and that's all cured up. Over here wasn't really a repair, it was just uh, where the bracket goes to bed this in. Now I did the same thing, there's a plug over here and there's a plug down over here that I had filled in the same way prior to laying up the glass. But uh, yeah, the inside's done, we're going to let that cure. And then we're going to flip it over and we're going to work on the, uh, the top side. 